recently appointed Inspector General of Punjab Police Inam Ghani has said that maintaining law and order in the province, ensuring prompt solution to the problems of citizens and ensuring uniform rule of law is his top priority. To meet the expectations, all the principal staff officers posted in the central police office and the command officers posted in the regions and districts will have to play their effective role in the best possible way. He further said the officers and personnel who would bring the oppressors to justice and support the oppressed would be the vanguard of his team so that all officers should keep themselves active for further improvement in the process of public safety and service delivery. He said he will make sure that transfer postings are based solely on performance and good reputation so that all officers should make selfless service to citizens without any pressure and rooting out criminal elements should be their motto. IG further said policy of zero tolerance on harassment and corruption would be strictly implemented and additional IG internal accountability bureau would be fully independent to take so more action on corrupt cases as well as complete inquiry and punish those responsible. He further said corruption, abuse of power and killing and torture in police custody at any level in administrative and professional matters would not be acceptable. While action under zero tolerance should be ensured against the officers and personnel involved in such irregularities. The newly appointed IG expressed these views while addressing his staff officers at the central police office side by side talking to media. Responding to media questions, he said there is no grouping in Punjab police and all reports regarding grouping of seniors and juniors are contrary to the facts and baseless. In Amgani said CCP Lahore, all RPOs, CPOs and DPOs are committed to protect and serve the lives and properties of the people by ensuring implementation of government orders and police is a disciplined force. The IG said special attention would be paid to the process of punishment and the best performing officers and personnel would be encouraged while those who committed non-professionalism and irresponsibility would be punished according to the discipline metrics. Inam Ghani said that timely provision of information would improve the relations with the media so that media would continue to identify crimes as well as publicize good work of the police. Clear on his arrival at the central police office, a well-armed squad of police extended salutations to the new IGP, while other officers including additional IGs and DIGs posted in the central police office welcomed Inam Ghani. The IG also held the first formal meeting with the officers at the CPO and issued important instructions to the officers regarding his policy, priorities and performance of professional matters. Additional IG PHP Captain Retired Zafar Iqbal Awan, Additional IG IAB Azhar Hamid Khokhar, Additional IG Training Shahid Hanif, Additional IG Research and Development Ghulam Rasool Zahir, Additional IG Establishment BA Nasir, Additional IG Safe City Rao Sardar Ali Khan, DIG Legal Jawad Ahmed Dogar, Additional IG Logistics and Procurement Ali Amir Malik and Additional IG Operations Ulfikar Hamid, Additional IG CTD Muhammad Tahir Rai, DIG Zaim Iqbal Sheikh and others were present in the meeting.